Here we have a 2014 Fiat 500 Lounge three door hatchback in white. Starting with the offside front tyre. Tread depth looking at easily a good four to five millimetres in the centre there. Looking at the offside of front alloy, lovely condition all around, no curbing or scuffs. Looking down the offside of the vehicle, taking a good look down there, I personally cannot see any sign of any dinks or dents. Body where it looks very nice. Front arch is tidy. Driver's mirror has got some light scratches to it that will require a bit of a polish. Driver's door itself. Again, some light scratches need a polish there. Door edge is pretty clean, no chips there. And again, one or two light scratches below the driver's door. As you can see, up the pan roof on top, which is a very nice feature. Moving towards the rear arch, again, some light scratches around the arch. Uh, they've actually had uh, paint previously to these, as you can see. Um, so it might need a bit of a better job um, at getting those painted in. Apart from that, the rear quarter's tidy. Rear tyre, a good 4 to 5 mil of tread there as well. And looking on at the rear alloy, once again, that's immaculate with no curves or scuffs. Moving around to the rear end of the car. On the rear bumper, very clean, very tidy, no sign of any damage to report there. Everything appears to be in good order. Again, just a little bit of polish on the loading bay. Inside the boot, you've got your parcel shelf, lovely clean condition. Underneath here, you've got your spare wheel in there as well. Moving around to the near side rear tyre, again, good 4 to 5 millimetres of tread there, easy. And looking on the rear alloy, once again, lovely clean condition with no curbs or scuffs. Looking down the near side of the car, once again, no sign of any dinks or dents, body wheel looks very clean. Uh, door edge there is fine, again a couple of light scratches will need a polish on the door, a couple of stone chips in the mirror require touchings. Front arch is tidy and the front tyre good 4 to 5 mil there as well so plenty of tread on all four tyres. Front alloy, again no curbing or any scuffs there, so real nice condition all round. Bit of a scuff on the front there requires some paint. One or two stone chips around the front end, again will require some touchings, but no signs of any damage there and you can clearly see it's been taken care of. Interior here on the driver's seat, you've got the uh, cream leather here as well as the cloth. Again, lovely condition all round. Passenger seat again in nice condition. Looking at the back here, doesn't look like they've been used before. Very tidy with no signs of any damage there. Inside the vehicle, you've got the nice uh, sort of white cream uh, dash and steering wheel to match the exterior of the paint. Stepping inside the vehicle itself, we do have two sets of keys with the vehicle um, as well, as you can see just there. So two keys with the car. Also looking at 16,770 miles on the clock and just getting the vehicle started. As you can see there, no issue at all at starting the car. Um, warning, low fuel, so again no issue there really. No symbols at all on the dash and again the car runs exactly how it should do. Radio works perfectly fine, no issues at all there. Again, all the blowers work, air conditioning does come out lovely and cold, so no issues there at all. Again, that lovely pan roof there, lovely feature. Apart from that, it's all good. V5, we're looking at one owner from new. Um, obviously, it's not required an MOT. Its first MOT will be the 21st of March 2017. And it is full franchise history. You've got a service receipt here, um, done at 9,701 mile there. Um, that was done on the 24th of April 2015. So as you can see, full franchise history, but there we go, it's the 2014 Fiat 500 Lounge, and it's a lovely looking car with very little prep needed doing to it, and it could be straight onto your pitch.